Happy Rusev Day! The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, accompanied by the ravishing Russian Lana from Bulgaria, weighing in at 304 pounds. There's Rusev. only one holiday worth celebrating 365 days a year. You know what that is, Byron? I don't know. What is it, Corey? It's Rusev Day. There it is. Rusev Day is a real-life phenomenon taking the world by storm. It really is a holiday, Byron. It pops up on my calendar on my phone. Okay, so uh, no matter how you feel about this made-up holiday, what it has done is uh, provide virtual jet fuel for the confidence of Rusev, who is more driven than we've ever seen him. Corey, he just said it was made up. Byron, when's your birthday? August 20th. Cancel Rusev Day. Oh, man. The excitement level just went through the roof in this arena. One half a team extreme. The charismatic enigma about to grace the WWE Universe with his presence. from Cameron, North Carolina, weighing in at 225 pounds, Jeff Hardy. A true daredevil in every sense of the word, Jeff Hardy is immune to fear. Synonymous with tag team title reigns, a former United States champion, former world heavyweight champion, and what's amazing to think about, guys, is that the career of Jeff Hardy started at just the young age of 16 when he made his WWE debut. Oh, this is gonna be good. And their opponents, first, from Huntington Beach, California, Weighing in at 282 pounds, Samoa Joe! One of the baddest dudes to ever play the game. The first two-time NXT champion. A world-traveled, world-class competitor. One of the most well-rounded athletes sports entertainment's ever encountered. Yeah, the scenery may have changed in Samoa Joe's career, but the attitude is still the same. Samoa Joe does what he wants, when he wants. A very dangerous, dangerous man. The eclectic Shinsuke. And his partner from Kyoto, Japan, weighing in at 220 pounds, the United States champion, Shinsuke Nakamura. Corey, this man has taken Dodi Dodi by storm. You're absolutely right. And since WrestleMania, since this, quote, change in attitude from Shinsuke, some people have called it some sort of psychological downward spiral. I think it's been an emotional ascent leading Nakamura straight to the top. Well, that ascent has made Nakamura one of the most dangerous superstars in all of WWE simply because you never know what he's going to do next. Confusing, charismatic, and dangerous as the day is long. The Bulgarian brute looks ready for a fight. If history is any indication, that means this match is about to get ugly real fast. Drop kick! It hits the mark. Oh. <laughs> You 
got to believe this one's over. There he goes, crashing to the floor. He wants no part of this. Most of the truly great tag teams in sports entertainment created a double team finishing maneuver. The spike pile driver from Anderson and Blanchard, the heart attack from the Hart Foundation, the rocker dropper from the Rockers, or the doomsday device from the Road Warriors. A team needs to have a tag team finisher and be able to execute that finisher on all types of opponents. Oh! Corey, a few moments ago, you mentioned some of the great tag team finishing moves in sports entertainment history. Don't forget about the 3D from the Dudley Boys or the double drop kick from the 2017 WWE Hall of Famers, the Rock and Roll Express. In tag team action, like in singles competition, once a duo nails their opponent with their finisher, that should signal the beginning of the end. It can take a long time for a tag team to decide on a double team finisher, but I agree. A team needs one, and it should be something that can be administered to any opponent. That's when a finishing move is truly effective. And since we're talking about tag teams, remember you and your partner have until the referee's five count to execute the move. Shinsuke Nakamura had a whirlwind first year on the main roster. He made a SmackDown Live debut the night after WrestleMania, and one year later was competing in a dream match against AJ Styles for the WWE Championship. There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Michael brought up Nakamura's first year on SmackDown, and there were both highs and lows. He had a great match at Backlash against Dolph Ziggler, but faltered during the summer, losing back-to-back -back title matches against Jinder Mahal. Yeah, but the artist turned it all around with the performance of a lifetime, winning the Royal Rumble. However, he failed the title opportunity at WrestleMania, causing Nakamura to show his true colors. A crazy year, that's for sure. Yeah, let's hope he can keep oh, this man. kind of effort going. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history books forever. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. I may think the pop. The accolades locked in. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. Rusev causes mass destruction wherever he goes. The hero of the Russian Federation. Wow, he got out of it. Yeah, I'm not so sure he had it fully locked in. Nailed it. Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. Shinsuke Nakamura just too fast for him. It's like trying to fight smoke. Looking for the win. Rusev twist the face. That should do it. Here he goes. Harsh impact. That's what he was looking for. One, two, three, three. What a tag team display. I can't remember a tag team match in recent memory that was even close to as good as that one was. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. Another exciting tag team match in the books. It's performances like the one we just saw from these guys that makes tag team wrestling so exciting. And it's matches like this one that makes SmackDown such a success. 
Thank you so much for joining us.